In this video, I will explain how to estimate the gradient of a curve at a point. So when we speak about the tangent to a curve, we simply refer to a straight line that touches the curve. So suppose we are interested in the point with coordinates negative 9, 9, and we would like to find the gradient of the tangent. So it's the straight line that just touches upon this point, something like this. So the first thing to do is for us to draw the tangent at the given point. So we take our ruler, we place it close to the point, we rotate it so that it just touches upon the point. A rule of thumb says that we look for equal angles with the curve on either side of the point of interest and then drawing the straight line means that we're interested in finding the gradient of this straight line here. So let's record that given two points, we can easily calculate the gradient by saying the gradient is y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. And there are cases where we will be asked to proceed in finding the equation of the tangent. We also need to draw our attention to the fact that uh, each one of us will draw a somewhat similar but not identical straight line, so we expect different yet similar answers with regards to the gradient. In this example, we are asked to estimate the gradient of the curve at the point 5, 12. So I will start by marking the point on my graph and I will get my ruler and draw a line that just touches upon this point. So there it is, I've placed my ruler, I will draw the straight line and I will identify two points through which the line passes in order to proceed in finding the gradient of the curve. So I see that I pass through these two points here, it's the point with coordinates 9, 19 and the point with coordinates negative 2, 0. So let me write them down, it's 9, 19 and negative 2, 0. So this is x1, y1, this is x2, y2, and therefore the gradient would be y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1, which gives an answer of 19 over 11. And therefore we conclude that the gradient of the given curve at the point 5, 12 is 19 over 11. In the second example, we have to find the equation of the tangent to the curve at x is negative 5. So going on the graph, when x is negative 5, y is 10, so the point is minus 5, comma 10. I will draw the line that just touches upon this particular point. So there it is, and then I will identify two points through which we pass. The first one is the point here, minus 4, comma 3. And another point is at minus 5.5, 5, comma 13. So I will use these two points to find the gradient. So let me write out the two points. It's minus 5.5, 5, comma 13. And then minus 4, 3. So the gradient will be y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1, which gives an answer of minus 20 over 3. We've got the gradient of this straight line. We know that any straight line has a general equation of the form y cos mx plus c. And we have already established that m is minus 20 over 3. I will use the fact that when x is negative 4, y is 3, which means that 3 is minus 20 over 3 times negative 4 plus c, so 3 is 80 over 3 plus c, which makes c be minus 71 over 3, and therefore my final answer will be that the equation of the tangent is y is minus 20 over 3x minus 71 over three. Thanks for watching. If you found this video useful, please like it and subscribe to our channel. You can also leave a comment below to tell us what you think.